what's up guys today i will show you how to download any youtube video on your local machine with your preferred quality so let's get started okay first you will need to have python installed if you don't already have it installed you can simply go to the official download page uh, and download it from there by uh, hitting the download python 3.13.1 or whatever version is available for you at uh, as a time okay uh, now that you have Python installed, we can use PIP or PIP package installer to install our first package, which is yt-dlp. Okay, uh, so open the command line as administrator and run the command PIP install yt-dlp. Okay, and hit enter. Uh, this package is essentially used to download YouTube videos. Okay, now we need to uh, uh, install a chocolatey package manager for Windows by simply going to the official download page here. Okay, we will first open the command uh, or Windows PowerShell. Okay, and run it as administrator. I forgot to run it as administrator. PowerShell run as administrator hit yes and now we need to follow the instructions for the download here by first running the get execution policy command in the powershell copy this paste it and now if it returns uh, if it returns um, um, restricted then you need to run set execution policy all assigned so we will run this command to make sure and hit A and press enter and now this is set. Now we can run this command to actually install and download Chocolatey on our local machine. So we'll copy this command and paste it in the PowerShell here, hit enter and wait for it to download. Uh, okay, so it's now downloaded and installed on your local machine. So now that you have uh, Chocolatey installed, we can use it to install another required multimedia framework called FFmpeg which is used to essentially uh, combine the downloaded files since YTDLP downloads audio and, uh, and video files separately and to be able to combine them we will need to use FFmpeg multimedia framework to combine their streams okay okay inside the PowerShell we will need to run Choco and uh, to 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 actually verify that Choco has been installed in your local machine, you can run Choco and wait for the output. And now it should output it should output a Chocolatey version, which is 2.4.1 in my case. Okay, now we can you we can use it to install FFmpeg framework by running Choco install FFmpeg. Okay, and now we can hit enter. Now it's installing uh, FFmpeg multimedia framework for us. And uh, we will need to uh, then add the bin folder for the FFmpeg framework and the environment variables path. So we'll navigate to uh, the bin folder for the FFmpeg uh, framework, which is essentially created at C, Program Data, Chocolatey, Lab, FFmpeg, Tools, FFmpeg, and then bin folder here. We will copy this, pa th this path open the environment variable by searching for it environment variables here it is click on it click on an environment variables now inside user variables uh, search for path this path here and click edit now click new and paste the copied path in this uh, input and now you can click uh, okay, so uh, it's, uh, it's already uh, found here. So click OK. Now for the system variables, same approach. Navigate to or search for path. Double click it or click edit. Now click new, paste is uh, the covered path for the FFmpeg bin folder and click OK. OK and OK. So this should add it to uh, add FFmpeg to our uh, system variables we can verify this by running the command ffmpeg dash version and this should return 
uh, an output for ffmpeg will find that it has already installed and executable by uh, our system okay okay so we now we need to we now need to go to github guest where the code for the the Python script is available we can we can click row here for the YouTube downloaded pi file and hit control s to save it in your local machine and save it on your local machine now i have it already installed on my local machine so i can open it in visual studio code for example and run this file so we can run this parcel script using parcel interpreter we will go to the command prompt and hit the command python and then the file name which is youtube download.py and hit enter now we need to we, we need a youtube video link so i have prepared a video here this video here uh, but you can choose any video of your choice if you want i will copy this link and paste it here as input to the script then hit enter and now it will ask you to input your result quality uh, or simply you can hit enter to display the available quality for uh, for, for this video and now it's extracting the available quality options for this video and now the available qualities are these 12 qualities here we can choose for example a uh, 480p which is number 8 I will hit 8 and press enter now it is downloading this video file for me in 480p quality and this is downloading here wait for it to finish now it says download complete successfully we can navigate to our folder here which you will notice that it created a downloads folder where it, inc where it, inc it includes uh, the downloaded video file here which was hosted on the official YouTube uh, web page and this is the file here PyTorch in open source and you can verify that this file is downloaded in 480p quality okay so this concludes this video thank you for watching and happy coding i will see you in another great video thank you